When you're building a new home, there are some key indicators to look for to make sure the quality of your home is what you want it to be. Construction codes evolve and materials used in home building improve, so typically newer houses outperform existing houses on most measures. In new construction, people usually just walk through model homes and finished homes, but today we're going to talk about the things behind the walls. I'm Charlie for Centex. When you've decided to build a new home, there are four key things to look for to help make sure your builder will deliver a home that lasts. Builder experience, project oversight, high construction standards, and warranty. First, builder experience. How long has the builder been in business? Do they stand behind their work? Determine how long they've been building homes and what their background in the industry is. Do they have experience building the type of home you're interested in? At Centex, we have over 65 years of experience. We pay special attention to critical areas of the house, ones that are most prone to long-term issues. We have an industry-leading warranty. Our construction standards meet or exceed industry standards. And we are very experienced in building homes across the country, so we know what it takes to build across climate zones and different soil types. Next is project oversight. Before building your new home, the builder should outline the process for how the project will be managed, including who to contact with questions. Ideally, you'll have one highly trained person that you can be in constant contact with to avoid miscommunication. They should touch base at regular intervals and allow you the opportunity to see progress at key points in the construction process so that you can efficiently track the progress of the house. At Centex, we do exactly that. Our build quality experience process includes a dedicated field manager who walks through every home, every room, every day to inspect individual features, marking those that pass with a pink dot. This step-by-step -step quality review signals our commitment to quality and make sure that nothing is missed. For more details about the build quality experience, ask a salesperson to explain the construction process. Now we're gonna spend some time looking at building standards. This is where we go behind the walls and look at things that home buyers don't often see. Let's start with the foundation. It's probably the most important part of the building process. Not only does the foundation support the house structure, it also keeps out moisture and cold. It's critical that your home is designed by a licensed professional engineer, that your foundation is specific to the soil conditions of your lot and has the correct footing size, concrete thickness, and rebar. Even more protection against water intrusion comes in the form of the vapor barrier under the concrete. With this barrier, your home is better protected from the issues that water intrusion can cause, like mold, dry rot, and other problems. At Centex, your foundation and vapor barrier are designed by a licensed engineer and inspected by your field manager and the city or town which serves as an important neutral third party. We inspect during the foundation creation and back it with a 10-year structural warranty. Once the foundation is set, the next step is framing the house. You need to be sure your home is professionally engineered for the correct loads to meet your local building codes. At Centex, we use industry-leading construction techniques like properly framing with open corners to insulate for optimal performance. We also have standardized process for inspections all along the way especially after the mechanicals are installed, to make sure there are no compromises. We double check framing after plumbing and electrical to ensure nothing was modified or damaged along the way. This ensures no walls are bowed, everything is level, and all structural components are properly installed. Let's take a look at water and draft protection. Protection against moisture, wind, and pests. Moisture is the number one cause of damage to homes after they're built, so it's important to know that you're protected against it. There are significant considerations for both the exterior and the interior of your home. First, the exterior. Your outer layer of defense includes the vapor barrier, flashing, ceiling, and roofing. The vapor barrier is more than an extra layer of protection that secures the building envelope from the outside. It's also an added level of assurance that homes will feel more comfortable on the inside. It helps eliminate drafts in the wall and helps reduce energy costs. Plus, it allows optimal breathability, allowing moisture to pass to the exterior. For flashing, the seams are carefully sealed to reduce excess airflow. We employ specific flashing techniques to create a shingling effect to help keep water outside the home. Sealing is when we weatherproof wall penetrations. Butyl tape is used at all windows and doors to reduce the risk of water damage and excess airflow from entering the home. 
Weatherproof wall penetrations are installed at exterior wall plumbing and electrical penetrations to provide a sealed air barrier and reduce the risk of water intrusions that may lead to mold, dry rot, and other problems. As for the roof, we utilize a roof penetration system that includes underlayment, target flashing, and kickouts to prevent water intrusion at the roof. Moving to the interior of the home, we start with special membranes in the bathrooms, under the tiles. Bonded waterproof membranes, like the schluter curdy membrane, work to form a fully bonded watertight assembly for tiled showers. Unlike shower pan liners in conventional installations, these membranes bond directly to the mortar bed and protect it from becoming saturated with regular use. This enhanced step helps to protect against mold and mildew. Spray foam is used to seal construction joints and window frames. A foam seal is preferred because it expands to fit into tight spaces and helps to limit leaks and drafts, keeps bugs out, and helps reduce dust and allergens. Next, let's talk about energy efficiency. In every climate zone, it's important to be properly insulated to help build energy efficiency into your home. Here's what you should look for. Low E windows help reduce energy loss and control heat transfer. The appropriately sized heating and air conditioning unit is needed to efficiently heat and cool your home and to help lower energy consumption. The correct insulation type, whether it's blown, bat, or foam, each has its strengths. We use each type as needed to best prevent heat loss and drafts. Insulation split. This minimizes the void around plumbing and wiring with full depth insulation. At Centex, we make sure the depth of your attic insulation is correct for your area of the country, minimizing drafts and maximizing energy efficiency, so you're more comfortable and can enjoy lower energy bills. These are the details we care about and inspect to ensure you have a quality home. Having the latest wiring and technology helps ensure your home works the way you want it to today. Having a strong electrical backbone in the house is so important in addition to electrical wiring, you'll want to make sure your home is equipped for the latest technology. This includes things like router placement and Wi-Fi coverage, and using CAT6 wiring, which is up to 10 times faster than CAT5 and supports up to 6 times the bandwidth. Of course, Centex also has the latest smart home options to make your home even more intuitive and ready for whatever's next. As part of our build quality experience process, we show you the wiring location as part of an inspection before the drywall goes up. This walkthrough is the first time that you get to see the house as it's being built. It lets you experience the layout and start to see where the outlets, appliances, and everything else will be. When the home is complete, but before closing, it's time for final inspections. These are performed by the field manager, the municipality, a build quality manager, and you. We make sure everything is exactly as it should be. Then it's time for closing, when you get the keys to your new home. Ensuring quality doesn't end at closing. That's when a warranty really becomes important. It's a promise from your builder to you that they stand behind their work. Always ask what type of warranty is available. How does the warranty compare to others regarding length of time covered? How long is the structural part of the warranty good for? Pay special attention to what's not covered in the warranty. For example, does the warranty cover water infiltration and leaks? Water damage is the number one challenge for new homes, especially in wetter climates. You want to make sure your builder is committed to a waterproof home. Also, make sure you understand the process to submit any warranty service requests. Does your builder have a designated system to easily submit service claims? Our warranty is an industry-leading 10-5-2-1 warranty, meaning 10 years of structural warranty, five years for water infiltration and leaks, two years for plumbing, electrical, HVAC, and other mechanicals, and one year for materials and workmanship. If there ever is an issue, we'll service your request when submitted, rather than making you wait a specific amount of time. And requesting service is a simple online process. To find out more about our warranty, watch the warranty video on our website. Centex is always researching and innovating to build the best quality new homes. We are continually working with manufacturers to develop innovative practices and better quality products. In short, 
Our 65 plus years of experience, combined with our build quality experience, means you'll be living in a home crafted for your life now and for years to come. For more information, talk to your local sales consultant or visit us online.